When Rockridge Stud presented their newest stallion to breeders at its January open house, everyone already knew Mind Control from his exploits on the track. And they're off. Mind Control's win in the grade one cigar mile capped off a career that saw him win 12 of 29 starts, including 10 stakes. They're off in the hopeful. Beginning with the grade one hopeful when he was two years old. Mind Control. And the grade one Alan Jerkins at age three. And a dramatic finish. He's going to be very exciting for New York. The racing, the breeding, these babies will go into the right hands, and everybody that's involved is buying mares to breed to this horse. Rockridge Stud's owner reminded breeders that Mind Control's owners, Red Oak Stables and Madigat Stables, stayed in on the horse as several New York farms worked together to form a partnership to make sure the $2 million earner would stay in New York State. Basically, Loray and I and Rick Burke at Irish Hill and Jerry Belinsky um, have been talking at, at Waldorf, have been talking about doing this for years. And he came along and it just gave us the impetus to do it. The unusually bright winter weather drew a large crowd to the stallion show. Breeder Vivian Malloy proudly introduced her homebred stallion, a shin forward. He won $3 million a grade one, a miler, all the good stuff that you want for a stallion. And his first New York crop, all running in New York. So now they're showing their stuff. They run, they're fast, they're gutsy, just like he was. There are five more stallions on the Rockridge roster, all looked great. This is Al Khali. He's a medallion doro out of a Capote mare. He's a multiple grade stakes winner, grade one place horse of over a million dollars. And he has had limited crops, but uh, he has six winners from only nine runners. Multiple graded stakes winner, Disco Partners first crop, will hit the track in 2023. They've sold really well. His first crop of weanlings and yearlings brought 42,000, 27,000. His second crop, um, he had two sell for 35,000, one sold for 27,000. So they've been very well received commercially, which we're very surprised and delighted to see. Um, so hopefully they're in the right hands and we see his two-year-olds come out busting this year. This is Frank Conversation. He's a son of Quality Road out of an unusual heat mare. Multiple graded stakes winner of over 500,000. And his first Foals are three-year-olds of this year. Grade one winner Slumber earned more than $1.4 million and has had astounding success from two small crops to race. Fluffy Socks is from his first crop of 17 foals. Side Dog is from his second crop of three foals. So he has two graded stakes winners of 20 foals. It's a very impressive 10% strike rate. And the Rockridge roster is completed with the son of Tisnow named Tourist whose connections think he will prove a standout in New York. Multiple grade one stakes winner of over $2.1 million. Fastest Breeders' Cup turf mile in history. He had eight stakes horses in 2022, including grade three stakes winner Wintrue. Rockridge believes Tourist will be a good fit for New York, as his offspring have been winning on every kind of surface. In Hudson, Tracy Egan for nybreads.com.